AS24, as part of Total Energy's company, we have the ambition to meet net zero together with the society. This gives the opportunity to AS24 extra motivation to fasten the energy transition. Our ambition is to lower our CO2 emissions significantly and to be able to propose new proposals for customers that fit to new mobility and new energies mobility. So today, for the development of our network, we are buying plots where we can install EV loading installation and facility, as well as being able to propose H2 hydrogen on the plots also. The station of tomorrow, this multi-energy station delivering CO2-free energy, will suit to the demand of the heavy-duty segment transportation. Today, we act as a responsible market player in our daily operations. On the station we manage, we take care of the impact of our activity on the environment and the biodiversity. That's why we recover rainwater to reuse on site. This is what we do in Mer, we do it in Rodange, and we do it also in Houdin. So we are here in Meer, which is the biggest station of uh, AS24 Europe. The station has uh, 12 lanes, has uh, 13 islands and uh, 29 dispensers, of which also HVO 100 biodiesel. We have here also LED lightning, which is uh, economical lightning, uh, working on movement sensors. So when nobody is here, it's minimum light. When there is movement of a truck, there is maximum of light. So here we are in a wildflower area, so this is the greens. Normally it's all grass that we use, but uh, grass asks for a lot of maintenance. With wildflowers you have less maintenance, that means less energy is used and it is also very nice for the insects, of course. We are in Luxembourg at the frontier with Belgium and we are at our station Rodange. At this station there are nine lanes, six lanes for S24, three lanes for Total Energies. At this station we sell DSL, AdBlue and HVO 100. This station has an enorm roof of more than 1000 uh, square meter. All the water uh, will recuperate it and store it in a bassin under the ground. It's a bassin of more than 150 cube liter of water. This water we can use for the toilets and the, the rest uh, will use for the fire brigade when there is a problem on the station. This plot was an old industrial seat uh, that was abandoned and therefore there were a lot of animals who lived there, which one of the animals was a salamander. To protect the salamanders, we decided to build a wall of stones between the station and the environment where the salamanders were living. In the next station we will build in SPI, we will also take special measures to protect special orchid. On another station, in Houdin, we are actually building a three-lane station with a special canopy to have solar panel on it, so on the side we will produce green electricity. For the fleet of our company cars, we are actually switching all the cars to full EV cars. When we look to our offices in Brussels, in a new building which is carbon neutral and which is also accessible very easily by public transport. So for us, net zero ambition by 2050 is achievable if all stakeholders work on it as from now.